Okay. Hi, this is Mercy. And this is Liz. And uh, we're from Groove and Moms. And I just want to say uh, that today I went to the dentist and I got my uh, teeth cleaned. And that's a very important uh, thing to do. Oh, yes, very important. And uh, what I like about going to the dentist is you get like a little goodie bag. You get a toothbrush. I got toothpaste, a little cute little mouthwash, and a, and a floss. Yeah. So um, uh, the thing about going to the dentist is uh, we don't like going to the dentist uh -huh. because uh, we shared um, a, a, an experience. Very bad experience growing up. Uh, we were uh, school bused with a lot of children in the 60s. Uh, to Guggenheim School of Dentistry, oh, yes. School of Horror. Yeah, definitely the uh, uh, Hall of Horrors. That's yeah, definitely is. Um, was because amazing. what I found amazing was they drilled every single tooth. Yes, we ha My dentist says that I have so many cavities. You know, no. fills, fillings. Just fillings. Say. Just fillings. God only knows if we had cavities. You I think didn't. they just took the drill and just, you know, yes. they were experimenting, learning on our mounts. Yeah. I have so much feelings that there is no, an impossible to ever have a cavity again. Right, because there's a, there's a shell. It's a shell of a There's no enamel. It's all uh, <laughs> filling. And that's why they break so easy. You have to be very careful about eating anything hard because if it gets too hard, there's no support on the tooth. It'll just... Right. And a lot of children went through that in the 60s. It yes. was a bus, it was somebody's brainstorm, I guess Guggenheim, <laughs> uh, to, uh, to, to bust all these innocent it was children. Free. It was a free uh, benefit that was given to the uh, neighborhood kids in the city. We grew up in Manhattan. Second Avenue, 29th and, uh -huh. Street. And uh, even though we begged our parents, Please, we don't Please want to don't go. Please don't go. It was, oh, you have to get to the dentist. You have to take care of your teeth. They uh, even pull teeth out. I mean, yeah. you're nine years old. What teeth did they pull out? Uh, yeah, remember the floor? If it was, I, the, was the pulling floor. So everybody horrible. would be like this, saying, I hope I don't get, was it the fifth I floor? I got it twice. Fifth yeah. floor? I fifth got the floor. floor. I hope I don't go to the floor. If you got called your name and said, go to the fifth floor, everybody <laughs> was like, oh. <gasps> You miss, you're you losing the tooth. <coughs> and your sister, what happened to your sister? With the drill. Yeah, right they down drilled her, her lip. Right, right down here. It was terrible. She's still this And I'm sure that some of those students would, didn't even become dentists. They might have become steam fitters or something. I don't know what they, what they did. <laughs> because some of them were like, uh, they were not nice. They used to drill and talk to the other dentists yeah. as they're drilling in your yeah. mouth. And Conversations. And they're like, how, how are you and today? You're at, you're and you're going, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts, and they don't care. They don't stop. They just so, keep going. Just take your children to a children's yes. doc, dentist. Our advice, yes. And uh, listen to your kids when they beg you that not to go to a dentist say you got think about it say i wonder why they don't want to go to this dentist the best thing to do is take your children to a pediodontist right and that's what i did to, for my children and they love the dentist yes i mean and they have such great teeth i wish i could say the same that is one yeah. of the things that i really feel bad listen about. we have our teeth so it's I genetic i, know, well, I think true. we're good thank our parents but you know what gums are the issue that's why you should floss Floss your way every day, okay? Okay. So keep smiling. That's right. And question. <laughs> <laughs> and floss.